I think we can all agree that keeping children safe at school is one of government's most basic obligations to parents. We have a new health epidemic in school which warrants our attention to that obligation, which are life-threatening allergies. According to the sponsor of my measure, the Food Allergy Research Education, or FAIR, organization, as many as 15 million Americans suffer from life-threatening allergies. It's estimated that nearly 6 million of these people are children under the age of 18, which is about two in every classroom. Approximately 25% of first-time allergic reactions that require epinephrine happen at school. Recently, this issue even drew the attention of President Obama, who signed a federal law which said um, states who require stock epinephrine in schools may receive preferential treatment in the awarding of certain grants, which is H.R. 2094, School Access to Emergency Epinephrine Act. He also noted his own daughter has a peanut allergy. Given this new incentive from the federal government and the prevalence of life-threatening allergies today, an increase of 50% since 1997 to 2011, according to the CDC, it's necessary for California to revisit this issue. Current California law allows schools to stock epinephrine, but has not required it, putting some students at risk and making California potentially ineligible for this federal incentive. My bill, SB 1266, will require extra epinephrine injectors to be stocked at schools. Anaphylaxis is a potentially lethal allergic reaction, and the numbers of children with this condition are skyrocketing. It can happen when a person is stung by a bee or ingests foods such as shellfish or nuts or maybe even just comes in contact with something as simple as latex. Epinephrine is the first line of treatment for someone who is experiencing anaphylaxis. It can be easily administered and has little side effect. Reactions can be so severe, even fatal, without prompt use of epinephrine. Current law requires prescriptions for epinephrine be made to a specific student in order for the medication to be stored at schools so that it can be used in the case of an anaphylactic reaction during school hours. SB 1266 will require extra epinephrine injectors be prescribed as a standing order so epinephrine can be on hand in all public schools. By ensuring schools emergency medication is available at schools, we can be sure that all students with allergies are safer at school, even when they don't know they have an allergy. By requiring stock epinephrine as described in SB 1266, we are enabling our state to compete for federal dollars and provide our school health professionals the necessary tools and peace of mind to keep children safe.